What is going on guys? Grave here today. Let's talk about update 3.2 we received today for Battlefield 2042. I will have these patch notes linked down in the description if you'd like to read over it for yourself. Let's go ahead and hop right into it. They fixed some issues today when quitting during a match that can make the game responsive. They also updated the behavior of the quit button during gameplay so it actually returns you to the correct screen. They fixed an issue where the loading music would stop playing during uh, you know, the levels loading up from match to match. And they also fixed an issue where connecting to the EA servers after signing up with a new account was not working correctly. Uh, they fixed the rare occurrence where after landing with a wing suit, hits wouldn't always register on some parts of Sundance's hitbox. They fixed occurrences of rubber banding when you were behind friendly players. Also fixed the rare issue that could cause you to be stuck in a both a live and a downed state. A variety of issues while uh, kind of working with ladders that could cause you to get stuck in a state where you could lose control of your specialist. They also fixed an issue where soldiers' movement speed was impaired by explosions. Um, the issue of camera shake and audio for landing would unintentionally trigger when you were jumping or falling from very small heights. They fixed an issue where the weapons from the loadout crate would sometimes uh, not work previously as they should have uh, you know with the correct selected weapon that you have chosen to use when you went to that loadout crate and they also fixed an issue where being spotted when firing a weapon would spot you for way too long also they added multiple fixes to improve overall game stability they fixed uh, related crashes that occur for amd radeon users when sundance was visible on their screen the sniper and soflam scope glints now show for further distances they fixed an issue where passengers would no longer be in sync with the driver's turns, uh, would rotate, causing bullets not to register when firing at enemies. The M1A5 and the T28, they improved the effective range and reduced the spread on weapon on the canister weapon pod, reduced the bullet spread from 1.6 to 1.1, and they increased the damage falloff distance from 35 to 40. Also, they fixed an issue in hazard zone or the, where there was a black rectangle present on screen during the end of the round. Uh, or when you hit the quit button uh, at the level progression screen. They also fixed uh, some things within the Battlefield portal itself. The server info tab now uh, still works after hitting refresh in the portal server browser or works correctly. They fixed an issue where the text would overlap when joining a team deathmatch game during the end of the round sequence. The rules editor uh, value now correctly handles melee weapons and certain admin commands can no longer be spammed. Uh, like I said, this update did come out today. They're talking about more updates coming out really soon with a new leaderboard and things of that nature. So I'm assuming we're probably going to get an update again pretty quickly. I would guess probably next week. I'm assuming it won't come out this week, but we're going to have some leaderboard updates. It looks like they're finally starting to fix some of these issues that have been in the game since launch. Now, will it bring some of the player base back? Who knows? I mean, it's done it in the past with, with other EA and, and DICE games where Battlefield was kind of in a rough state to start and then, you know, couple months a year down the line uh, the game is well improved compared to what it was to begin with and players you know kind of come back and start playing i'm not sure how this will go with battlefield 2042 it's got a lot of uh, kind of hate from the community since it's been out a lot of people don't like specialists so i'm not quite sure how they can really mend the issues they've had i think adding some new maps some new weapons uh, things of that nature things from battlefield 3 bad company 2 those kind of maps i think would make players happy We'll just kind of have to wait and see. But of course, the next update we get, I will bring you guys another video for that. But leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.